Uh, thank you, Mr. St. Patrick, for um, stopping by today. Um, as you might have known that I am Mr. K.O.T. That stands for King of the Thirds. And I have a thing where I like to help famous hoes across the world um, find happiness by giving them paid dating advice. The reason why you're in my office today, Miss St. Patrick, is because you've been a hoe since season one. You've been doing hoe activities with hoe tendencies. Hoes are your friends. Hoes are your enemies. Um, what hoe activities might you have been doing since season one? Well, I you gave Sean a private masturbation show in the back of the motherfucking car. You were throwing the kitty cat at Sean. You were looking hella thirsty for Sean. Um, for a woman that says you don't like square ass bro brothers and you want ghosts to stay in the drug game, be the biggest drug dealer of them all, you have a habit of receiving a lot of square ass dick, bitch. Um, sweetheart, it's just not good. Plus, you couldn't let Sean be with Keisha. You stole Sean from Keisha. Now, we have seen what your husband does when somebody just insinuates that they're going to fuck you while he's in jail. You get your head smashed in. Um, so, basically, by fucking Silver, yeah, he's probably going to die. He's probably going to catch a bullet. So, Miss St. Patrick, in my professional opinion, um... Cut the whole shit out. I mean, you've been doing the whole shit since 94. We all saw your portrayal of Lil' Kim and Notorious. Good job, by the way. But yeah, um, yeah, just stop. Stop. Miss St. Patrick, no. No, no, Miss St. Patrick. I've seen what your husband does. Keep your clothes on. Keep, keep, keep that. No, no. Stop. Stop. Uh, no, no, no. Control substances or hand to hand. White collar visions. Game changing mission.